Hi guys, welcome to Excessive Game. I'm Excessive Brutality and thanks for joining me on part one of No Man's Sky, developed and published by the indie studio Hello Games. Three years in the making and finally it's out. I mean, this game was difficult to get for me because I had to go to three different shops and they were all sold out or whatnot. Uh, eventually, one of the one of the guys at one of the shops had decided um, to give me a copy from someone who had uh, reserved it that hadn't showed up um, for a day. So. I, I don't think it was fair, but then again, you know, I really wanted the game, so sorry for whoever that was. Thank you very much. Um, very happy, actually. All right, I've been playing this for a bit now, so um, let's get into it. I need to find some zinc to repair my ship. Um, so let's see if I can find that quickly so that we can get on our merry way and move the fuck out of this flipping planet, which is driving me bonkers at the moment. Let's get in the ship a minute, because we've got some enemies coming. All right, so I fixed the launch thruster, and we just need to fix the uh, need to fix the pulse engine. But I was pretty sure I had iridium. Oh, something is not cool. Okay. All right, though. So we need to fix this. Paris technology. Now, can I charge the equipment? Can I charge this with plutonium and get the hell out of here? <clears throat> charge equipment with plutonium. Okay. So, um, I need to gather materials to get me out of here. So let's see if we can go down here and see what we can find. So what do we need? Press the L3 demo zinc to repair. Press L3. No good. Right in four minutes. Uh, grave. Well, I'm not quite sure. The problem is, problem. I'm, I mean, I can find everything else. Plutonium is not the problem. Be careful with these fuckers. Now I need to open that. I need a one times Atlas B1 pass. I haven't found one of those yet. I don't suspect it's anywhere around my ship, is it? These are the canisters dropped by the. by those. Um, Shitty things. I know how to call them. Anyway, we shall continue this way. See if we can find any of that zinc that we need. It's not really telling me there's anything around here, but let's see if the pulse brings anything back. I don't know if we are meant to actually explore much on foot, but as far as I can tell, it's not an easy task to get the ship repaired to start off with. I suspect we have to do a lot of walking. What happened was I actually got the Heridium. I actually managed to get the Heridium, but then um, I died. So, and I thought I would have uh, been able to keep everything I found, but it seemed like I wasn't allowed to keep it. And I've got something down there. So, um, my guess is, my guess is I explore them. Let's see what we got around here. Let's see what we get. Okay, so this is all procedurally generated. So it means that sometimes, you know, I'm looking down here, but what's behind this is not actually there until I go up here and it gets generated for me. So that means that no matter where I am, nobody can really help you with the game because everybody is in their own kind of existence and universe. 
so none of your friends I think that are playing will be able to um, find you or join you I, I'm not quite sure unless you're in the same game and then procedurally uh, generates for the two of you at the same time I'm not sure how that works or if it's even possible at the moment I have seen some spaceships but um, nobody nobody who stopped or anything I haven't seen anybody walking about I don't reckon I find anybody I can tell you straight off the bat this is a very very lonely start to a game I mean look at the size of this thing it's never ending never ending and I've been walking around for a while now and I've not found and I've not found what I need to repair my ship but I think persistence and patience is what's gonna pay here and uh, I don't think that I'm gonna be dragging you through the repair process once it's repaired then fair enough what that's marking a grave is that because I can collect what what uh, I died there. I'm suspecting that I can collect everything everything that I lost when I died if I go to my grave. So I think I will be trying that first. Because that's where I got all that heridium. I actually see what I mean? Look at the spaceships. Now that, that might just be a kinda of AI or, or whatever. Look at this man, this is awesome. I can actually walk on walls. Thank fuck for that. If you couldn't walk on walls you'd be here forever. Uh, jet jetpack as well. It's very handy. Um, so getting around is not hard. It does take a lot of time though. Uh, what is that down there? Arrival, grave. That's what, yeah, sorry. That is exactly where I was going. Sorry. <laughs> A bit confused at the moment. Radiation protection falling. Radiation protection falling. This is not a place you want to be, guys. Not hospitable at all, really. But one does what they must. We must survive. And I will survive after I go to my grave because I didn't survive last time. So I'm wondering whether this. I'm wondering whether I've missed the plot, I've done something wrong or this is really how the start is to this game it is I think quite grueling to uh, quite grueling to find these parts that I need we're talking about to walk for 10 minutes in one direction to get to get iridium and then I got killed and I was planted back at my ship and I thought I'd keep the iridium but I've lost it all I've not got it and I've lost a lot of stuff I found along the way as well so I'm not quite sure what's up. I'm not quite sure. See, that journey milestone accomplished. I already got that last time. Oh wait, no. I think this is 2,500 more than I walked last time. I think it was 5,000 last time. Well, I might as well gather some stuff while I'm here. I've got nothing left from what I had before. Motherfucking shit. I wonder whether my upgrades for my weapon they're all here the upgrades are fine they're all fine don't know whether I've got another upgrade I can put I don't know but um, regardless regardless at the moment it seems like the most important thing is the iridium and the zinc both of which are a pain in the ass to obtain. Like I said, I actually got all the heridium and it's back there where I died. Um, I, I suspect I can pick it up. I'm not sure yet. I haven't gotten that far. So it's just a matter of. Gotta be careful there. There's a. There's a bad guy there. I may not be a bad guy, I may be good. I may be the bad guy myself. I'm not sure yet. But I'd rather stay away because even though they're not difficult to kill, 
they'll call in um, they'll call in other other fucking bad guys and then you'll fuck with that shit. I wanna be able to do that. Okay, well I can't do it yet. As far as I'm concerned, I can't do it. L3 is looking, it's my little scan that pretty much scans the surface and uh, tells me what or where I can find, well, basically what's around me. Any minerals, any important things. Uh, I've found a couple of, of like, they look like um, big uh, statues or mon monuments, um, and they have learned a bit of this language, the language for this planet. Although I've not yet come across any any anyone really, um, but I have seen some of the wildlife. They haven't been inhospitable. They haven't attacked so far. The only guys who have attacked are those kind of sentry, floating sentry things. Um, and I've been able to kill quite a few of them. Just I got unlucky in the last one. You know, walking around like this, you are using up a lot of your your resources. Uh, there you go, life support systems at 50%. Obviously, it's protection, protection, uh, protecting you against radiation and stuff. My radiation is completely low now. I'm going to hit middle button and see. All right, so I need to charge this, but I don't have. Uh, that's not really what I want. I want to. Is that is that what I needed actually? I think it is. No, it's not. I've got no radiation protection, which means my health will be depleting constantly now. Now, to be honest with you, I am not sure yet whether. Um, I'm not sure yet whether it's probably a good thing when I just head back to the spaceship and then start from there. I can't believe I'm not allowed to fly my ship straight away. Uh, I don't know, unless I'm missing something. Nobody teaches you how to play this game. This is how it is. You get out there and you do whatever you gotta do. And for each person, there'll be a different experience. And for me, it's been a pain in the ass so far. Not, you know, not that it's crap or anything, just it's been a pain in the ass, because I really thought I'd be flying a ship soon. Oh, I don't need to do that here, I just need to kind of... Okay, I need to want to destroy that. Oh, iron takes forever to fucking destroy. Can I do it with my other gun? With my other... Don't do shit. What's that shit? I don't want that anyway. Alright, um, in case you missed it. Blue is uh, is for the enemies. Um, it's an upgrade I got. And if I press triangle, it'll switch to my... Uh, I found something there. It'll switch to my... To my gathering crew. Okay. Might as well get that. Carbon. What the fuck? Knowledge. This is what I've been find, finding around it. Arrive, you have learned to get word for talking. Okay, well that's three words I've learned so far. And I don't know whether I've actually kept the other words I've learned because, like I said, I've lost pretty much everything else. This is a bit dodgy, using that. But it's the pain in the ass. Pain in the ass, guys. All right. You noticed my voice is quite low. I'm not shouting as much as I do normally. I'm quite reserved. Um, my kids are in bed. I'm doing this straight out of a uh, straight out of work. With the, you know, with the kids. Way to bed. I got this out, and I thought I'd do a quick let's play to have ready on official release day. But by the looks of it, I'm gonna die again, aren't I? Oh, my health is pretty good. 
Radiation is pretty bad. Holy shit. Seek shelter from radiation. Restore hazard protection. This hazard protection. I can't charge it. I need zinc titanium. I need zinc. Seriously, man. Zinc? Zinc is what I need to replace my 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 thrusters. I don't think I'm gonna make it. Am I gonna make it? Five minutes. Alright guys, this has not been the most exciting. This has definitely not been the most exciting let's play, but you know, No Man's Sky. Let's give it a chance. I know it's gonna be good. It's just uh, this initial initial um, planet. Um, there's not much on the game out there at the moment uh, to tell you what to do on this first planet. But uh, I know one thing, I need to get zinc and iridium. And once I do, I can repair my ship and get the hell out of Dodge. And then let's go and we explore. But you'll see that in the next video. For the time being, I'm going to get this stuff sorted. And you'll see me back when my ship is online. Thank you very much for watching. I'm Excessive Brutality, this is Excessive Gamer. Catch you next time. Please hit that subscribe button if you like the video and you like the rest of my stuff. Got loads of videos up, loads of let's plays. I appreciate if you subscribe to my channel. And uh, I'll keep providing you with loads of content. Thank you very much.